Oh, okay. Uh, my, uh, I can't share my screen. It's disabled at the moment. Okay, now I can. Uh, so, as I think, I I looked up at uh, like uh, graphics and some studies about the cost of the senior developer and major developer. Uh, this was the average cost for them, but then again, uh, most of the time in like internet, they kind of put uh, lower salaries, maybe to like lower the expectations. And yeah, maybe I should like put it like 12 or thousand dollars. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, um, Calling it senior also hurts, um, you know, clear uh, clarity. So uh, maybe if you say, I don't know, three to five year um, experienced developer, uh, this could be what you pay for him. Um, or maybe even six, maybe seven year experienced. But if you want something you know, more than eight year experience. This is impossible for him to work for you. Um, other than that, can you, yeah, can you go ahead? Uh, your gun chart. Okay. Yeah, this is little, it's impossible to, uh, it's, yeah, it's kind of hard to actually, let me, yeah, I mean, maybe um, as a general idea, maybe if you have a, a, such a detailed uh, long gun chart, uh, it could be um, more meaningful to create a second uh, less detailed gun chart uh, that shows you the milestones of your project. Uh, and milestones are the important ones. So uh, you can have you know, beta release, uh, prototype, alpha release, etc. So, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I do have that, but uh, yeah, I see the point. Like, maybe like uh, cut the chart in half and yeah, uh, because after the fourth month, we have alpha release and uh, I can like uh, use it at a, at a different gun chart, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, actually getting rid of, um, I mean, maybe a high level gun chart that has. I don't know, seven to eight lines is okay. So it's, I mean, you will be spending around one minute at most while you are talking in this area. So, uh, I mean, even seven to eight lines is, it, it, even it could be too much, actually. And uh, finally, can you, um, yeah, financial projection slide is also too much detailed. Uh, I'm not sure about your marketing strategy. Uh, I will actually ask uh, someone who works in my company uh, to, to um, validate that. <laughs> I feel like it should not work. I, I know uh, the skin price thing. The combined. Yeah, I mean, uh, uh, I I kind of I, I actually like when I uh, have that idea. I kind of. Like uh, search for it, and even uh, yeah, yeah. Of course, it may not work, but I search for it, and it says that like when you get like when uh, people compare two things, like because uh, three of the lower tier is equal to higher tier, and they yeah. will. Think, I, like, I, I get the math. Three dollar, but that's five. Why should I pay five dollar? It's not working for everyone, but it works for uh, some people and if I get like even one more people with this uh, strategy it will be a uh, it will be good it will be more money uh, is there any uh, evidence in your pitch deck or is there any source that supports it in your uh, pitch deck uh, actually uh, no I didn't uh, include it but I in your uh, documents up. if you have in your document that's also fine ah okay you, I, I actually I have... should have, I should have included it yeah okay uh, then, I mean, it's it will be hard for you to prove that. Uh, 
yeah. Um, I, I mean, uh, hypothetically, it could be relatable because uh, people who plays MOBAs like to prove a point, okay? So to prove that they are more intelligent than the developer, they can pay the developer. So <laughs> it can, I mean, it's, it's possible, but uh, I mean, you should <laughs> support this. Yeah. Well, then again, even though like if does not works, uh, still the prices I don't think like they are really like like they are not that high. I don't think they are that high because the main audience will be the Europeans and the United States. So I think like one dollar or five dollar is not a big money for them. Yeah. Like okay. if you convert it to Turkey, yeah, of course it's it's not like no one will pay twenty dollars for it tier one skin or sound effect or particle effect or whatever mm -hmm. but maybe like uh, we can uh, adjust the prices for specific areas mm -hmm. if we want but for starting i thought about like going for usa and europe alone okay. and um, do you plan to publish your game in uh, in steam yeah, of course it will be. It will be a, a, com a computer game, not a mobile. And uh, uh, but uh, my my first thought was instead of uh, publishing in it in Steam, uh, publishing it on in our own site. But then I thought it would be harder for uh, for me for us to find a sufficient player base because it's easier to uh, reach people in Steam. And I, I think I would use Steam and Epic Games too, actually, like both of them. Uh, by the way, um, I had a similar marketing strategy. Uh, let me tell you that. So um, maybe it could work. I'm not sure. I, I haven't tried, but um, selling um a player 10 gems for one dollar mm -hmm. and uh nothing is purchasable uh with 10 gems okay so uh you can buy um some things for um nine gems for instance and the lowest price for item is uh nine gem so whatever you do uh, you can't spend the remaining one gem, okay? And because of that, people will feel the need to, you know, um, uh, efficiently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They want to um, be efficient uh, with their money, and they feel like their money is lost because they cannot spend the remaining gem. Because of that, they buy additional gems. Uh, for instance, they buy uh, nine. They spend nine dollar to get, and you know, ninety gems, and they this way they can buy uh, ten in-game items. So, this is a uh, uh, you know way. Uh, th this this is more efficient way. I, I mean, uh, but yeah, uh, these kinds of strategies should be tried. By the way, even if you don't have uh, something like that in your report, if you send me a resource. Uh, I can accept that. Uh, okay, I, I will. Can uh, I will? Just send me that. Uh, and uh, for our next uh, homeworks, just add, add those kind of things into your uh, report. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, so, uh, you plan to release it in only one platform, right? Yeah, only in okay. uh, computer. I don't so, plan, because I don't think the game is suitable for mobile. Okay. Uh, then my bonus question is, let's say that um, uh, while you are developing this game, Steam adjusted uh, the cuts ratio uh, by 10%. 
how will you adjust and uh, and it's uh one and a half years of developing so after i mean you have uh, six months to uh decide uh to stick with your um strategy or change your uh strategy uh if you stick with your um strategy uh you i mean your um your cuts will be more uh, by 10%. So do you, I mean, how do you mitigate this? How do you adjust? Well, if it's like six months left, it's almost like uh, two months away from open beta. Okay. So I could uh, migrate to Epic Store instead, instead of using Steam. And uh, since like i did already the alpha release and uh i probably did, did it on uh steam and epic too so since i already like released it on steam for the alpha i believe like we should have at least discussed this kind of cuts like beforehand and and if it didn't and they change it uh close to our uh, game release and I probably would migrate to Epic Games if uh, it like doesn't uh, affect or uh, gain or uh, or revenue too much. Because since this is a free game, and I'm not sure if uh, uh, Steam take cuts from the in-game sales, but if they do then I probably would migrate to Epic Games until it's sufficient for us to like uh, accept that 10% cuts from the team. Okay. Do you have an achievement system uh, or? Uh, not, that I, not that I think of, but I also included uh, uh, in, the, in, our, in my uh, high design docu document that I will create a Discord server and uh, Reddit subreddit for the game. So, if the player base uh, suggests me that, then I would uh, include that after the full release. No, so no, I, because... I just okay, okay. Uh, the reason I asked was because it's uh, hard to um, give up on your uh, already developed achievement system. If you already developed it on, for Steam, uh, you just wasted months. Yes, months. Yes. months. No, I, I didn't. You wasted, you wasted precious time, uh, and also, um, will you uh, release your game in Epic Store by the same uh, from the same price? Uh, the game will be free. The only, okay. only think uh, the player will pay will be the looks mm -hmm. and the sound effects and the and the other things like okay. particle effect and yeah, it will be fully visual so th then that price will be sticky or will it yeah, it will be, it will be sticky for both steam and epic because like if i like release for both of them because then people will say like why would I play on Steam if it's like uh, cheaper on the Epic Store? And okay. it will be, it wouldn't be actually like uh, ethic ethical thing to do as well. Yeah, uh, nice. So uh, it's a hard question, but uh, I guess my uh, answer would be, um, you know, um, admitting some of those cuts. Um, so you can um, stick with your plan. Uh, you can raise your in-game um, currency by 5%. And uh, you can stick, uh, not stick, but you can um, take the 5% damage. So you don't adjust uh, i mean you don't go out of your way 
because you all, uh, have limited time uh, and you i mean since if something like that happens in real life everyone will raise their prices in steam markets so this is ex expected yeah, uh, true. so it's possible for you to raise your prices too uh, and you get roughly the same uh, revenue yeah. uh, okay uh, this is all uh, I wanted to say uh, it's taking too much time for one person well uh, <laughs> okay who wants to go next are you ready Ushik? I can't teach you Hello. Hello. Um, tell me when you're ready, and I'm going to start. Uh... Wait a minute. Okay, I am ready. Wait. Uh, let me just find. Okay, I am ready. Okay, three, two, one, good luck. Hello, I want to, I will present my game today. Uh, its name is War of Kingdom. Uh, War of Kingdom is a single player, just PC based because it's a so detailed game. And strategy, medieval game, where players can build and develop their own kingdoms and fight the other kingdoms. You are born in a kingdom and um, you are working as a farmer, as a soldier, as a, um, I don't know, any other things. And one day you are decided, you are, you want to, you want to uh, create your own kingdom and you are living your own kingdom from the others. You are walking uh, from the walls and you are creating a small village firstly and you are creating wood buildings um, like homes, markets, markets uh, other things. It's, it's in Roma period. Roma period. Uh, Inspiration from Age of Empires and Medieval Dynasty. Uh, it's looking like that you can see as a third person, third person. Like maybe you are hunting something and you can take your uh, weave as first person. Uh, next. You can. You have a backpack and you have you can crafting something like knife, boots, and you have backpack behind you. And uh, we are beginning uh, in June 2020, and we are raising our alpha version in June 2021 and after six months we are solving problems in December, December 2020 and uh, we are releasing our first version of the game in June 2022 uh, our expected cost is the total cost of 10 person team salaries for two years, computers, tables, office, and programs to be used in $5,000, $500,000. If things do not go as decided, this cost will increase to $650,000. Our expected return financial project is uh, we are we are giving to streamers, YouTubers our games because these times uh, so many people 
looking for how many people watching games from Twitch, uh, YouTube, and uh, they have many um, they have many people they are watching them, and but they want much money, but we will pay much money, but they will so many people see this game on there. And thank you for listening. Thank you. Uh, and you spent four minutes, uh, which is not bad, uh, but you know, you could talk, you could give some more details. Uh, so can you um, review your slides? Can you show them again? Okay. Which page? Uh, I just go one by one. Uh, everyone, uh, I guess, uh, showed some inspirations. Uh, this is not a must. I just keep that in mind. Uh, it's okay if you have, but it's not a must. Uh, so go ahead. And uh, yeah, you you haven't recited your um, pitch sentence, uh, so yeah, uh, this is a little bit um, problematic. Uh, can you go to the crafting page? Uh, yeah, it's. I mean, for you as a gamer, maybe it's obvious that this is a crafting page, but for um, mortals. This is not uh, looking like that. Uh, I mean, th there are many different examples of uh, crafting pages. So uh, you could uh, find better examples. Uh, and also the writing's really small. Uh, yeah, can you go next? Also the, um, you know, the Titles are in different places in each slide. Sometimes, yeah, yeah. Cool. sometimes uh, bottom left, sometimes left, etc. And this one doesn't have a title. Uh, and uh, game ads promotion solving problems. Uh, the time. I'm. I, the good thing is you have not put many things in this slide. So it's understandable. Uh, you you give some milestones. So this is pretty good. Uh, rather than calling first version, you could say uh, gold's version or something like that. It's more uh, of a term, you know, it's uh popularly used can you um uh, yeah click that yeah rather than hmm. yeah the the better way of delivering this info could be writing 10 persons i mean 10 people right write 10 people and then uh draw a you know arrow and write two years to on top of this arrow and uh just say it's it's uh half million dollars uh and also uh you can share the other uh you know uh, worst case scenario as well uh, I mean, it's not too much of a detail, but still, uh, I'm saying this for everyone, not just for you. Uh, and can you click the last slide? Not, yeah, this one, eight slide. Uh, what is opera? Uh, you're right. I mean, still, what did you want to write here? They want to wait. Uh, like, okay. 
Let me say. Um, they want money uh, like uh, wait a minute i thought that before a few days ago and i don't remember do you do you want to say upset upset mm. i guess it's a, so i don't understand i mean you, if you want you can Tell it in Turkish. Rüşvet gibi yani rüşvet demeyelim de yani daha farklı bir şey demek istedim de Türkçe'si İngilizce'sini bulamadım. Öyle çevirmiş. Hmm. Okay. Um... Ya yani oyunu ha. yanlamak için para yani. Kaç para istiyorsun gibi bir şey. Ha anladım. Yani sen Twitch'çılara oyununu oynatacaksın. Onlar da para al- alacaklar diyorsun. Evet. Okay okay tamam okay. So this is, I mean, it's okay, but uh, if you uh, are not sure about something, just um, stick to what you know, uh, and you can, you know, instead of this, you could simply say, uh, they will ask uh, money to play our game. It's, it's also okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's not <laughs> complicated. Uh, No matter how much money we spend, tens of thousands of people will see the game instantly. So the purchase will be too much. Okay. Mm. Yeah, this is... I I wouldn't put that. <laughs> Because this is... Uh, this looks optimistic rather than realistic. Uh, you are already aware that you miss some important slides and your, um, you know... Uh, you have not but you covered almost all of them too so uh, i mean don't worry too much uh you message me before and it's it, i mean it's okay uh, and as a bonus um question let me tell you um let me ask you um Okay, first of all, do you have an age restriction? What is the age restriction? <laughs> upper the 15 year. Upper the, upper the 15 uh, age. Okay. Okay. And can you go back? Uh, so I, I just want to see your pitch sentence. This? Yeah, yeah. Uh, um, so, okay. Um, and can I see your Gantt charts again? So, okay. I, I guess you don't have, right? But, yeah. Okay, okay. So, let me ask you then. Um, how many time are you planning to spent uh, on enemy artificial intelligence and h- h- do you have a you know uh, is anyone in your team have experience uh, creating artificial intelligence artificial in- intelligence nedir hocam uh, yapay zeka yapay zeka yine sorar mısınız uh, so how are you going to Um, I mean, what is your plan uh, to uh, include artificial intelligence in your projects? And uh, how much time do you want to spend on artificial intelligence? Just a year. No, I mean, your game takes two years. So. Yes, our first alpha version is Realize it after one year. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but for the, you know, your game is single player. And in your um, pitch sentence, you say that y- your um, player will fight with other kingdoms. Okay. Yes. So ho- how can you do that with uh, adding, by adding artificial intelligence to uh, other kingdoms, right? Yes. Yes. 
and uh, like what is your expected um, time efforts for uh, creating artificial intelligence for other kingdoms? Ee, tam olarak sormak istediğin şey anlamadım. Ee, tamam. Ee, şimdi tek oyunculu bir oyunda e, diğer krallıklarla savaşabilmen için diğer krallıkların da seninle savaşması lazım. Bunun için de diğer kral, krallıkların bir çeşit yapay zekaya sahip olması lazım. Evet. Tamam ben diyorum ki development zamanı olarak e, development maliyeti olarak ee, ne kadarlık bir maliyet ayırdın bu kısma? Bu kısma 100 bin dolar ayırdım. Okey. Ee, peki zaman olarak kaç ayda bitirmeyi planlıyorsun? Şimdi bütün oyunu zaten e, yapay zeka bütünleştiği için yani ne yaparız zaten yapay zeka ile yapacağız zaten yani bütün yani bir senede alfa versiyonu çıkar zaten bir senede yapay zeka versiyonu şey olması. Yani oyun zaten yapay zeka üzerine kurulur. Öyle diyebilirim. Okey okey ama anladım. Ben şey üzerinde soruyorum. Ee, düşman yapay zekası üzerinde. Anladım ben size ama mesela ee, sadece düşman zekası değil ki mesela oyunda hayvanlar da var. Ondan sonra normal şeyler var. Yok yok onları düşünme. Onları düşünme. Sadece ee... Düşmanın hiçbir hamle yapmadığı bir oyun düşün. Tamam mı? Aha. O oyuna düşmanın hamle yapabileceği geliştirmeleri yapıyorsun. Anladım. Ee, bu süre ne kadardır diye bekliyorsun. Şimdi yani ilk versiyonda bu çıkma, bu çok iyi çalışmaz zaten. Yani buna 5 ay versem yani yine iyi çalışmaz. Bu en fazla, bu yani Yaklaşık iki senede bir buçuk sene buna gider diye, diye planladım. Anladım. Ee, okay. Ee, if uh, you expect this much time and uh, you are actually correct uh, to some extent, it takes more than um, I mean it takes uh, at minimum around a year to develop. Okay. Uh, Because, I mean, your game will be complex. This is the problem. So, yes. um, it will resemble, you know, um, somewhat of, uh, I don't know, Metiniki, uh, I guess, right? Uh, or, or um, uh, like a Age of Empires. Mount, Mount Embl- okay, Age of Empires. Okay, yeah, yeah. This is a better example. So, um, I mean, in Age of Empires, uh, like there are a lot of different choices, uh, but somehow uh, computer decides cleverly, uh, and it does it in a rather, um, you know, quick way. Uh, but I mean, still though, I played Age of Empires too, and it's not too much uh, clever, so it can be done. Uh, it can be developed uh, within, I don't know, uh, maybe six, eight months. Uh, and by by that, I mean one or two developer will be working on it. So. Uh, Because of that, uh, first alpha version, it will be very small okay. uh, place. Hmm. Yeah, I would suggest you to postpone your alpha version and um, actually, no, no, it's okay, so, I mean, uh, with your so you, um, you are you planning to uh, make your players see your version uh, in June uh, 2021? Uh, can you say again? Uh, are you planning your players to see your game uh, in June uh, 2021? Uh, single player. Yeah. Are you planning your single player? Yeah, of course, of course. Of course. Alpha version 
it can it will be but it will be in very small uh, place maybe it can be, maybe it will be just two kingdom in the place okay um okay this is all so thank you um is there anyone else who wants to present I can be the next. Yeah, okay. Go ahead. But, uh, by um, the way, does, no does anyone want to locate any problems uh, to, you know, red, uh, increase Ushik's point? Hello? Yeah? Is it my turn? Who, oh, sorry, who are you? Ushik. Uh, okay, no, no, uh, I just asked uh, them to uh, criticize you so that you get, you get more points. Uh, but no one does that, and we the have... The presenter was uh, Barish, I believe. The last presenter was not Barish. Yeah, okay, okay, sorry. <laughs> I, I thought, yeah, sorry. Uh, since i never seen you guys, it's uh i thought ushik was present so this is sorry uh yeah uh i'm going to send you a new link okay uh and we will continue